Welcome to the presentation on fecal sludge and septate treatment plant. This video gives a comprehensive overview of the process involved in the treatment of fecal sludge and septage. Fecal sludge and septage is collected from the septic tanks periodically and transported to the treatment plants. It is available in raw, partially digested, slurry, semi-solid form. The plant is provided with biometric axis control to ensure security of the plant and prevent entry of an unauthorized personnel. Vehicles will be discharging fecal sludge and septage into the collection tank. The septage will flow into the equalization tank by gravity. Screens are provided to screen all uh, non-biodegradable material present in the septage, such as water bottles, plastics, etc. After screening, septage flow through two sluice gates. These two sluice gates control the flow of septage into the respective tanks, that is, either to the storage tank or to the equalization tank. Storage tank acts as a buffer. Equalization tank is required for the following reasons. It regulates the flow into the anaerobic tank. It equalizes all contaminants. Biological water with high density population of microbes from the aerobic tank is introduced into the equalization tank to ensure reduction of an ammonia in the septage. Anaerobic tank. In the anaerobic tank, heavy shock loads will be taken by the process. Organic material will be digested and released uh, methane and carbon dioxide gases. It liquidifies slurry and semi-solids. It denutrifies nitrogen for further homogenization of the septate. Return is provided from the aerobic tank in terms of biological water which has a very heavy density of microbes for further biological treatment. Aerobic tank Biocleaner machine is installed in the aerobic tank uh, with uh, immobilized microbes media. These microbes media get activated in the presence of water and oxygen and microbes are released continuously uh, in the aerobic tank. Microbes population will multiply into trillions through a continuous process leading to accelerated digestion of the entire slug. Settling tank Settling tank has a tube settler which helps in reducing the suspended solids available in the treatment. Phosphorus removal tank Iron media is introduced into the phosphorus removal tank and phosphorus is uh, get attracted by the iron media and it is taken out periodically. Sand filter. All residual solids along with helmet eggs will be filtered. Chlorination. It kills all bacteria before discharges the treated water. Self-sustainable streetlights are installed in the premises. Borewell is provided. A small composting is also provided as a contingency. A green belt will be developed in the premises. In-house lab will be set up to monitor the quality of water at different stages. Solar power plant will be installed in order to meet the power requirement of the plant. Firefighting system will be provided in the premises. Backup generator will be made available in order to ensure uninterrupted power supply. 